Hello everybody, today I'm going to explain the problem F, Hate and Imperfection from the Code for this round 1032, Division 2. This problem is quite interesting because even though it's a Div 2 F, it's not too hard and it's actually quite easy if you know how to approach it. Basically, after reading this statement, you will realize that we need to minimize the maximum GCD of some set of numbers in range 1n. It's quite obvious to see that uh, the answers for sets of size 2, 3, up to n will always be increasing because adding some number can only maximize the value of GCD. Now I'm going to show my approach to this problem and a way to come up with it in case of a contest. In order to do this, I draw in a sketch pad the divisors of all numbers in range 2 to 12. Since we are only required to print the answers for sets of size 2 up to n, because they found it obvious that we should always take in the set number 1 at the first step. So they decided to skip printing that set. Now, the diver, I'm go, I have written the divisors of numbers from 2 to 12 in increasing order. What I'm going to do is to mark the biggest divisor of those numbers, which is not the number itself. Why have we marked the biggest divisor except that number? Well, if we add that number in the set, it's going to be the first one with that divisor. Why does this happen? Because it's always optimal to add a smaller number over some multiple of that number, because that multiple of the smaller number has also other divisors, which uh, if we add in the set, the value of the GCD is going to increase. Basically, we are now trying to minimize the biggest number such that uh, there are at least two numbers which have that divisor. Because if we have two numbers which have some divisor, then their GCD will be always bigger or equal than that divisor. Now, I have marked the biggest divisors in order to be able to sort the numbers from 2 to n in the increasing order of the biggest divisor. Basically, we are going to take numbers like this. Firstly, we are going to take the prime numbers 2, 3, 5, 7, 11. Their biggest divisor is 1, and none of those uh, numbers are uh, not co prime. Like if we take each pair out of those five numbers, the GCD will always uh, return one. Now we are going to take the numbers such that their biggest divisor is two, basically four, and that's it. Then we are going to take the numbers with the biggest divisor equal to three, which are six and nine. As you can see, all the numbers which are unique won't be a GCD except for 2 and 3 which were already fixed and this helps us to have an answer which is equal to just 3 after choosing most of the numbers then we are going to take 8 and we will finally have a number equal to 4 in the answer then we will take 10 which have it which has its biggest divisor equal to 5 and then last but not least we are going to take 12 which has its biggest divisor equal to 6 why uh, can the answer become bigger because uh, the biggest number will be featured only once and actually this is true for all the numbers bigger than n divided by 2 now i'm going to show you how to implement it in an easy way Basically, for each uh, number from 1 to n, we have added in some list its divisor. This can be done uh, in two lines, and its complexity is n log n. 
also we have added in some array the numbers from 2 to n. And we are going to sort them, as I said, in the increasing order of the uh, biggest divisor. Since we have iterated from 1 to n, the biggest divisors will always be in increasing order, and we don't have to sort the divisors array. Now for each number, we are basically going to iterate through its divisor, uh, divisors, which we found at the previous step, and we are always going to check if for some divisor, we have found another number which has that divisor before, in order to actualize the answer up to that step. Last but not least, we are going to print the answer up to that step, and that's it. If you liked watching this video, please like it, subscribe to the channel, and press the bell button in order to be the first one to have the notifications for the new videos. As always, good luck, stay healthy, and goodbye.